So coming up here to do some training, uh, like getting the benefits of the whole uh, high altitude training, it's, it's pretty key for uh, cycling and many other sports in general too. For me, I like to get up to altitude at least uh, two to three times a year and it's based off the events coming up as far as like if I have a race that's at altitude, I'll do a block before then. Or if I just have another race, even at sea level or just a little higher that I really want to target, I'll do another stint in altitude. So Mammoth Lakes is it's pretty great to come up here and train. Um, I've been to a lot of places to train at altitude and this is by far probably one of the best. Um, I mean, I'm sleeping at 8,000 feet, which is really good. And it's just great, you know, the weather's awesome, the training roads, there's climbs 10 plus miles, there's, you know, every day you can do a different training ride, but I can do six different climbs, like within, you know, 20 mile radius pretty much. I used to come up here when I was younger to snowboard, I was really into that. And then I got into motocross racing, I did that for a long time. And uh, then when I quit racing motocross, I got into cycling. I've come up for the Fonda. I came up last year for that, which was great. It was good times. This is when the first uh, I've really road cycled up here. So yeah, it's solid. It's great. Cause, you know, I started as a little kid snowboarding here. Then I went to motocross at the national, and now I'm up here training for road cycling. So I've kind of like done it all. Mm -hmm.